Hey, we ready. Hey, hey, hey. What's up, good people, aka winners? That's what we do. Hey, that's all we do. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> That was too slow. Wait, because I'm so excited. Oh my God, okay. I'm coming to you with another video. Hey, coming to you with the Cabbage Patch video. Vicky, Vicky, hey. I'm super duper excited. I know that it's been a minute. It's been so long. And I told you guys that I've had a lot going on in my life, but it was a lot of good, 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 good stuff. So in this video, Oh my gosh, I'm happy. In this video, it's gonna be a twofer, which is a two for one special. And so in this video, not only am I about to introduce a collab that I'm doing with Ofra. And the crowd applauses. Right? So anyway, I'm doing that, but I'm also preparing to do like some headshots and I'm actually going to do those myself. So I'm going to talk to you guys about, um, what I'm going to do in this headshot and I'm going to use my collab with Oprah and Seeky Beauty. So basically what this collab is all about, y'all know, y'all know it's the real deal. Holy feel. I have been loving Oprah for well over five years now. Matter of fact, I think that I met them in like 2013, which was, I think that was my first time meeting them. So when Oprah came to me and was like, Hey, we want to work with you and like, let's work with some of your favorite items. It was like hashtag winning hashtag score. It was easy peasy. I mean, it wasn't even a hard thing. Now you're going to see my mirror in the camera a little bit. Cause we are about to talk about this and, um, I'm gonna tell you why I selected these items too. But first I'm going to let you know that you get the whole bundle that I selected for $45. Plus you get to use my discount code. A a, which is C key. Now this bundle actually retails for like $84. So girl, I'm about to hook you up. Girls and guys, I'm about to hook you up. Okay. So hashtag winning. Okay. But, um, these are items that I love and this is what makes this whole like partnership collaboration. Like it just makes it like so bomb.com and we're going to get this all together in a minute. All right. But what makes it so bomb.com is I do not work with companies that I do not believe in or that I really don't use the stuff. So what you won't get here on my channel is, oh, I just love it. It's so great. And oh my God, and I'm clocking them dollars and it ain't real. We don't do that here. Integrity is worth more than any Thing money can ever buy. I'm just saying. So, and then I got to live with that. So what? So anyway, the items that I'm about to share with you guys are items that you have seen on my channel for years. Um, with the exception of the liner, cause it's new. Okay. Probably, I think it's like a couple years old. I am going to show you clips of me using it, but to be honest, like, and all the way real, I use this in every single video. Matter of fact, I have a whole video on this um this brow gel all by itself and the video is probably oh my god when did i do that like 2018 2017 i don't even know but it's really old it's it's old and i'm still using it so that ought to tell you something are you ready girl come closer <laughs> i'm excited so in this bundle first you will get the brow gel this is the dark brow gel i mean the dark brown brow gel however if the dark brown is not for you, you can actually choose different ones. Like I believe it's a taupe one or a khaki one. I will put it in the description box. But for me, dark brown is my zhuzh. I literally ran out of these because they had me stocked prior to them rebranding, right? I think I used like three of them, four of them. I don't even know. But this one I just got recently, like the end of last year myself. And real talk, now, I love Oprah, they love me, right? So I could have easily been like, hey, can I re-up? But like, I don't just wanna like reach out cause I want something, you know? So guess what I did? Baby, I went online and got some, okay? And so I got this one and when they hit me up about the favorites, I was like, yes, I love this and I definitely need more. It's a love thing, it's really serious. So that's how much I stand behind this product. The brow gel is regularly $24. This verified liner comes in this box. However, because it's a love thing, what? I think I'm gonna do a giveaway too, and probably on my Instagram, but check it out. 
because it's already here. We already ready. And I'm telling you, I'm very picky when it comes to liners. And then the last product, y'all already know, okay? Don't play with me. And I definitely have used a couple of these already because I've been using this for a long time. And this is, <laughs> I really want to have like lights, camera action or something as I open this like, Hallelujah. <laughs> this is Ofra Beverly Hills. Ofra Beverly Hills, meet the family. Family, meet Ofra Beverly Hills. I'm just saying. And this right here is my favorite. Now, this can definitely serve as eyeshadow too. I love their lipsticks too, but these three products take the cake. Everybody needs a little bit of brow gel to get their brows right to frame that face. I'm a makeup artist as well as a makeup instructor. Haven't taught a few classes in a while because I've been, you know, starting businesses and whatnot, okay? But framing your face is very important. And before I even do any makeup, I always frame the face and get the brows popping. And the thing that I love about the brow gel is even when it's hot, it stays in place. This is like, this is really good brow gel. Like seriously, I'll link the video from years back where I showed you guys I was using that. Ooh, bars, A. Hey. All right, anyway. And so the Beverly Hills, I also did, baby, like almost every daggone video, I use this O for Beverly Hills, which I love this shade right here. However, this whole palette will be good for so many skin tones, okay? If you're the fairest of the fair, you can go there. Boom, I could probably even use this one too. But one thing I don't do and don't judge me is I do not swirl because I don't know if that's the like OCD or whatever you wanna call it, but I can't, I can't do it. I can't bring myself to swirl. Okay, I can't. If you do, no judging. But anyway, every time you carry this baby around, you can think of me, I'm just saying. It's so cute, right? And so it's, it's like literally a little makeup bag and it holds a lot. All right, so what I do is I t now you can dip your brush in here if you want to, but I don't like to do that. And maybe that's because I'm a makeup artist and I just like keeping things sterile and sanitized. So I take my spatula, I go inside. I told you it's a love thing. I don't know what number bottle this is, but or jar. But anyway, I go into my spatula, put some on there, and I literally like like flatten it a little bit because I don't want to pick up too much on my brow. I mean on my brush, and also. That's probably way too much. It's not probably, it is. But I just like the security and knowing that I have enough there and I don't have to keep dipping, okay? So use it at your own discretion. And then I take a um, an angle brush and I like to use one that's a little stiff and then I just basically kinda put it in there a little bit but I need to concentrate, girl. And then I just kinda follow the natural one, the natural arch, like right there, that's where we start. And then we gonna fake it till we make it because we will make it because it's gonna grow back. And I just kind of draw the tail on. Now, a dibba dabba do ya? Because if you use too much, baby, you gonna look like a Sharpie. And see, I didn't used to be a brow gel girl. I can't even really say that. Wait, brow gel girl, right? And so I used to do like the pencil, but baby, once you go over brow gel, you don't go back, okay? So I'm just, it's a love thing and I tried everything when I ran out. I was using all kinds of stuff that was in my little arsenal, doing all kinds of stuff, and nothing compared. Now, what you wanna do is you wanna make sure that your hmms are equal. <laughs> okay, now they're not supposed to be twins, okay? Sisters are cool, and even sometimes cousins. But just make sure that your hmms are created equal. It's funny, because it was a comedian back in the day that was like, Women got their eyebrows done and they walk around talking about hmm when they draw them on. So it's it's just a ha-ha. Anyway, I don't think that this is super sanitary, but this works for me. Boom, shake, shake it. Boom, boom, shake, shake it. This is when you start feeling yourself. So insert dance. Hey, no, I'm just kidding. There is another product that I love by Ofra too, which is a brush. Now I use a bunch of different brushes, okay? But this one right here is really great for putting concealer on the eye. And I'm gonna do that. And then I am going to um, migrate over to the other part of the video. So if you wanna see the full video, cause I don't want this video to be too long. If you wanna see the full video on how I prepare for a headshot, then I am going to go ahead and, you know, refer you to that video cause I don't want this to be too long, but I definitely 
definitely want you to know about this brush. This is the Ofra Professional Makeup Brush number 20. It definitely looks like a painter brush, it does. But it's a flat type of um, concealer brush and I really do love this when I'm putting my concealer over my eye. But this should be um, part of the list of my faves, I believe. So now, I already started one eye. This verified liner is verified, it's confirmed. It is literally approved by me, like seriously. I'm gonna tell you why I love this so much and why I picked this. Number one, I, a wing liner is always like, it's always a way to go for me. It's always appropriate. It's always okay. It's always the right thing to do for me. Okay, I'm just saying. And so, and kind of sometimes I get carried away and I'm kind of like, I got this like Amy Winehouse thing going on, but it's all to the good. But the reason I like this is first and foremost, when I'm looking for a good liner, and I told y'all about this before, I gotta have the ball. Let me see if y'all can hear that and put it by my mic. Y'all hear that? I gotta have the ball. Like, because if not, then how can I get movement and make sure that my that the liquid is moving in there and I'm gonna get the nice amount that I need, right? I need it to be black. Boom, check, check, and check. Definitely black, right? I need it to have a nice point to it, but the point is so bomb. And I really, like it has some good staying power too, so I really don't wanna draw it on my hand, but I'm gonna draw it on my hand. Look at that. Oh, my, it's like a marker and it doesn't skip. That's important for me when I'm using a liner as well. I promise you, when Ofra came out with this verified liner, which it's, it's fairly new, I don't remember when it came out, but when it came out, I literally emailed them like, please do more colors because y'all did the doggone thing. I'm just saying, but let's see what I could do here. Let's see what I could do because I usually have to be up close and personal, but um, basically, because I want y'all to see that it's real, but uh, like, you gotta be quiet. Don't talk, just listen. I took the um, liner too high. I don't, like, this is all a part of it, okay? It, and that's one thing I love about doing videos and the, the beauty of transparency. It, I ain't gonna lie to you. It don't always come out right the first time. So I'm gonna wipe it, but you, you definitely need a wipe of some sort to make that come off right because that, once you get it in there, she in there. And that's how we get to be an Amy Winehouse. That's just how it happens. And then I end up going like all the way big. And so there it is. When you haven't done liner in a while, sometimes it takes you a minute to perfect it. And I may play with that little tip a little bit, but just so you know, it's juicy and it's black and you guys can see it glide on. I am gonna put on my lashes and stuff like that. And then I'll come back when the rest of my makeup is done and I'll show you the, um, the highlighter and all that. Cause is my judge. All right, so now we are back, okay? I just filmed my face for the whole, you know, for the other video. I'm actually gonna put on a blush real quick, and then we're gonna put on the highlighter, and I'm gonna show you where I put the highlighter in my eyes too. So I'm actually gonna go into this color right here, which is the best in the palette to me. It's just really, really great for deep skin tones. And then I'm just gonna put it right there. Baby, you should have seen me when I first used this. Now I am placing it right there and then I'm gonna take another brush and I'm gonna blend it out. This is just for placement purposes cause I, oh, oh my gosh, okay. Yeah, like, okay, I'm, I'm gonna leave that in cause it's real. Y'all know I love this. This is, when I go to events and stuff like that, always, always go with Beverly Hills because it gives me everything I need. I want people to see me coming, baby, because I want that glow. Okay, so that is to just place it right there. You could put a highlighter wherever you want to look dewy, but that is not my goal because in about two hours, we're gonna, I'll have all the do I need, okay? All the do I need. So I'm gonna go into the one on the Beverly Hills right here. Wait, right there, girl, I'm gonna go into that and then if that's not bright enough, I'm gonna do another one. That, that gives me, that gives me, that gives me what I need. And I think I want it even a little brighter. So let me see this color. This color right here, I'm gonna go on top with that and see what it gives me. If I don't like it, I can always go back on. Yeah, yeah, girl. Listen, that's the one I just used. This is the, the really, really icicle one. This is the one that has a little bit of purple in it. And purple can be used for illuminating purposes as well. And then this one is the really bright one. But also, if you wanna use it as an eyeshadow, you can. I have another video where I did that, but because I'm doing a headshot, I really don't wanna put anything on the eyes like that, right? I don't choose to do shimmer in a headshot. So I will come back and I will show you the final look and I'll be right back. 
So this is the final look. This is the whole collaboration with Ofra, y'all. I am rocking the liner, as you can see. And then I just had to, like, I had to give you the real, okay? I had to show you. So the liner, I told y'all that it would come out like A-okay, we good. And then this is the highlighter that I'm rocking, which is my favorite, y'all know that. And then the brow gel. I mean, and the thing about it is I'm, I'm so happy about this and I have to reiterate you guys that I wanted to come to you guys with these favorite products because these are products that I literally use all the time. I didn't go as crazy as I sometimes do go because I have a little breakout over there and it's a highlighter so it highlights areas, right? So I kept it a little bit subtle but I, you can even rock highlighter without putting on makeup, y'all. So even if you're someone that doesn't really do a lot of makeup, it just gives you that youthful glow. So I wanted to come together with them on something that you guys could use when you want just like a day-to-day -day look or something that you can use when you wanna just dress up. And I think we've accomplished that. So thank you so much, Ofra, for um, working with me on this. I'm super duper excited. Make sure you get your kit, okay, or your bundle, if you will. Three items, 45 bucks. You can also use my coupon code. And that is it, girl. I think I am headshot ready. You guys have an awesome, blessed day, and I will see you sooner than you think. Bye. Confidence is key. You know what I mean. A woman feels good when she's looking pretty. I don't need no Benz, Lexus, or Range Rover. Just give your girl a bomb, see key beauty makeover.